So today we're going to be hatching up all of those amazing rock drake eggs that we got in the last episode. But first of all, just pay attention to my leg. Like, what on earth? This is something I noticed that I could do with the little teleporter uh, thingy from S+. Plus. So just pay attention because my leg is going down somewhat normally. It's just a little bit far out. That looks a little sore. Then it's like stretched and broken at the knee and then it comes up and then my foot is the right way up, but it's not the right way up considering what, the way my leg is. I don't... This is so wrong. It's so disgusting looking, but there we go. We can fix it. Look at this. Like, this is so silly. It's like a weird snake or something. I don't even understand. Anyway, so yeah, we're going to be hatching up these rock drake eggs that we got in the last episode. Uh, oh. Okay, I forgot that I had that on. Great, I thought I was like literally going to go over and claim them, but I guess I left this thing on and... Wait, how many eggs do we have? I feel like we had six eggs, right? So, we yeah, we obviously got like triplets or twins or something. I don't even know. Let's see. Um, <laughs> great, that definitely doesn't help. I didn't realize that that thing was still on the little uh, dino baby collection thingy. All right, so anyway, here's our rock drakes. I guess we'll just check them out inside of the little uh, soul balls anyway. So... Uh, first of all, let me figure out which ones we got like triplets of or whatever. Um, wait, how many eggs did we have? Wait, okay, there's... I only had one, two, ten. This is very confusing. Okay, so I think I got twins on the 174, twins on the 204? Yeah, that works out. So twins on 174 and 204, interesting. All right, so first of all, let's just take a little look at the stats. That one there actually has a really nice melee stat considering uh, it's got 37 points into melee. That's actually pretty good. I like that. Um, this one here's got some pretty good stem and some pretty good weight. That actually could probably be a pretty good um, rock drake for stealing eggs because obviously having high weight is important because those eggs weigh a lot. Uh, this one here has got even better melee and it's got really good health. Actually, this one right here could probably be... Our main rock drake that is actually really good okay uh what else do we have here this is the uh, 174 so obviously it has identical stats to the other one because it's twins um that one's kind of like mostly balanced stats and the 204 is yeah we already had one of those uh this one here has got 40 points into stem which means that it could possibly be okay for rockwell but its health is kind of low so yeah, we have some decent rock drakes. This one here is probably going to be the better one, and then we'll we'll maybe use this 204 for um for egg stealing here today. So I, I think maybe I I don't think really raising every single rock drake would be smart. I guess so. Let's go ahead and just check out these two. Uh, some nice colors on this one here, actually pretty good all right so uh i do have a little bit of nameless venom and obviously it stacks because i'm using the stack mod so uh let me go ahead and just pull this stuff out and then just like give them a piece or two each because this is this is what they eat essentially so let's go ahead and just do that now obviously i'm gonna want some more nameless venom so we're gonna head down below with the spino and just farm a bunch of it it's really easy to farm all we got to do is just not be in our charge light from my little charge pet on my shoulder and uh, then we could just like just chill there and, and fight every single nameless that comes at me with my Spino. So yeah, we're not going to raise all of these. I don't think it would be very smart to do that. But these two over here are the better ones. So let's go ahead and do that. This one here has got like a little bit of blue on it, actually. I quite like that. Oh, is the belly kind of purple or something? It almost kind of looks like that. But no, I can see right here. It's kind of like white. It's really hard to tell the colors because Aberration has so many like... Did you just shit down my face? <laughs> Aberration has so many like crazy like colors and stuff all over the place. That was awful. I did not like that. I felt it on my nose. All right. Well, anyway, guys, go ahead. Do me a favor. Hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. It really just helped me out, and I do appreciate it. And uh, let's get going with this uh, little nameless venom heist. Heist? That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Farming thing. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Uh, we're just going to try and get some nameless venom, basically. So let's quickly just chuck out the spino. X Spino, there you go. Oh, Megalosaur, what level are you, bud? Uh, you're only a 102. Okay, I do have some pretty good Megalosaurs, but I, I mean, if I do find a couple high levels around, I'll probably tame them. All right, so first of all, let's turn off our light and let's put ourselves into this stance so we can kill them quicker whenever they start spawning. Any minute now, that would be great. Uh, no? Okay, cool. I guess we're just gonna chill here until they start coming. Hey, finally! My god, that took like a full solid minute. Um, okay, no nameless venom there. Sometimes it doesn't show up on the side there, you know. So that's why I wanted to check. Um, 
This will also be good because the Nameless Venom I have up there is like all ready to spoil, so I can like reset the timer on that stuff. Let's see. To be honest, having the stack mod really just gives me so much OP-ness. <laughs> in terms of, you know, like I, I could just have like 100 Nameless Venom in a full stack like that and just like force feed it to my Rock Drake to heal it really quick, which is obviously something that we want to do if we want to head down for some Rock Drake eggs. I'll probably want to bring the rest of my venom um there's like no nameless here why won't they start spawning on me i'm not in like light or anything do i have to be like off to, off my spino i don't think that makes any sense i'm pretty sure that wouldn't make a difference like they're not going to be afraid of fighting me nameless don't care come on there we go and hop off sweet all right you know what maybe i'll just like stand down here please nameless start spawning like light pad is off you don't have to be afraid no, they just don't care. Oh, I didn't realize I went over into uh, radiation there. God damn. Yeah, I guess it's radiation like right beside this little uh, thing, whatever you call that. We do have some nameless spawning though, which is great. Come here. All right, we got to kill that Arthro before it spits on me. I've already got shit on. I don't want to be spit on as well. Although I prefer the spit. <laughs> All right, here we go. Do we have any? No. Okay, come on. Give me all of your venom. So obviously uh, I do realize I could turn on my um, shine horn when there's a bunch of them, but I probably won't do that. The Spino is powerful enough to kill them even without the uh, charge pet. So yeah, we're, we're good. If you're wondering what this is, it's from Arc Editions. It's a concave nader thingy. So yeah, um, do we have any nameless venom at all? Nope, none as of yet. Come on. All right, we don't want to go over there just because of that radiation. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna see if they'll like follow me over this way because they're kind of still spawning on me just not a huge amount at once we also got a rock drake here as well hello how are you doing give me that feather and i'm gonna probably just drop all the rest okay yeah seriously lacking these freaking nameless right now come on wait did i just hear some i think i did it is super dark by the way even though i have gamma four on it's extremely dark there we go. Come on. All right, here we go. We got a nice little group of them. Four venom. Another six. Nice. I think, is that another six or? Oh yeah, no, that was an extra two on top of the four. And they're all gone again. Ah, man. I wish there was like a nameless uh, lore or something. I don't even know. It'd be great if I could just like do something and then they would all just come to me come all right we might need to head back up pretty soon here because we will need to uh keep an eye on these little rock tricks and imprint them and whatnot but uh we have six in total which is nice just obviously would like some more there we go okay i'm just gonna let a few more of them spawn and then we'll head up after this we can trample on them a little bit to kill them <laughs> all right we got another little pack of them here let's see all right another three venom not bad uh definitely not amazing but we're getting a little bit so that's okay let's go ahead and turn back on the light pet and i want to get back up to my base so put you away and then silky's right here boom wait what did i not grab the venom oh my god what i thought i grabbed it off did i not oh my god seriously ah, that was so stupid how the hell did i manage that how did i not grab that all right great well yeah that was really dumb <laughs> i'm sure many people probably saw me do that ah uh, that's so stupid all right let's see i i just i don't know i thought i grabbed it maybe i tried to and, and failed i'm not sure all right here we go and a boom all right let's see oh by the way speaking of silly mistakes yes uh you can use uh tech in the radiation i don't know what i was thinking like i was certain that you couldn't but i don't know why you know what? It was pretty late when I recorded that video, so I, maybe my brain just wasn't working correctly. But yeah, you can use it in the radiation. Thank you very much. Uh, is that other rock drake gonna move, or it, it might be stuck? What do you need? Cuddle. There you go. Wait, how much? Oh, hundred. Where the hell did you get a hundred percent? Okay. Uh, not sure why I got a hundred percent on the first one. There we go. All right. Well, I guess we don't actually need that much nameless venom now. Um. Great, let's go ahead and just grab that and just chuck that back into there. All right, sweet. So apparently they're just fully imprinted now, so that's 
cool, uh, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I didn't realize that that would happen. That is so weird. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna go with it. So, uh, is this one actually stuck? It might be. Let me go ahead and just pick it up. And then we'll just chuck it out over here just to kind of keep them together. And, uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit when these things are fully grown up. All right, so unfortunately, I've just realized I still need to get myself some, uh, red gems so I can go ahead and make this, uh, freaking, what do you call it? The saddle. So, let's see. Do we have any over here that we can mine? Um, I think we can, I think we can actually collect some from here, right? Yeah, those are red gems. Sweet. Okay, I was, like, looking for, like, this type of red gem right here where they look like the exact same ones that you have on Genesis, except they're not actually red gems over there. But, yeah, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and kill this little guy. Get off of me! Stupid... What are, what are these guys called again? Seekers. There we go. Words. All right. Uh, so here's the thing, right? Um... <laughs> seekers are gonna be back with Genesis Part 2. I do not like Seekers. That's going to be awful. And to be honest, actually, I'm, I'm almost kind of curious if we're gonna have new light pets. That would be interesting. Oh my god, wait, actually, we probably will. Because if Seekers are back, uh, then maybe light pets are back, and I'm wondering if we're gonna have a new one. That definitely would be interesting. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and get some red gems. Hello, pity we can't freaking get from those giant ones there. Those ones are massive and they have so many in them. All right, we only got like 25. I think we need a good amount for this saddle. I can check though. Okay, yeah, we definitely have enough now. There was another spot. Ah! Good, get away. There was another spot like uh, somewhere. There's some right there. And then there's like another one hidden inside the plants. Uh, can we grab the seeker? Oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, there we go. Great, now there's more seekers coming for me. Stupid seekers. All right, let's just turn off the light pets so we can kill them quicker. Oh, wait, no, you can't do that on a, uh, on a Bloodstalker. I forgot about that. Yeah, that's super annoying, actually. That really is irritating, the fact that you can't do the, uh, the light-up thing. Like, I can hit the little emote, but it just doesn't actually make a difference. It doesn't do it. That's super annoying. All right, whatever. Um, let's see. Uh, there we go. A little bit from there, and a little bit from this one, maybe? We don't seem to be able to. There we go. There was another one somewhere, right? There's like a little one. Um, I don't know where that one is, though. No, maybe not. All right, you know what? We probably, we have more than enough right now. So the Bloodstalker took just a little bit of radiation damage there, because I was down there for just way longer than I thought I would be. Um, but we have enough red gems, so let's see. Just gotta go ahead and craft the saddle now. We gotta take a look and see if we can find a blueprint for one at some point. What am I doing? Uh, rock. Rock Drake. There we go. One of those, please. Lovely. All right, sweet. So we're gonna probably chuck that onto this one to start off with because this one has the higher weight. And obviously that's pretty important if you want to be getting Rock Drake eggs. So boom. Let's do that, and let me just chuck a bunch of my other random crap into this thingy here. So, what can I chuck away? Like, what won't I need? Probably, like, a lot of these weapons here. I'll just keep my shoddy on me. Um, probably don't need the pike. Probably don't need that. And definitely don't need this, because you can't even use grappling hooks over here. Um, I Yeah, I'll leave that in there as well. Okay, cool. I think this is probably good, right? Yeah. Unfortunately, I will have to keep another set of armor on me because my armor is probably gonna break when we're down there so it, it's fine we can just switch to this stuff when we have that um okay cool so let's see uh let's put you away there bud boom did you have anything good on you oh yeah can't forget about that and apparently i got a ramshackle thingy and okay interesting sometimes you can get those off of like nameless and other creatures like that although i probably got those all off of seekers all right let's see okay Oh, I've already put the saddle on you. Okay. So, first of all, pretty good stats. You need do need to heal, though. And I don't know whether or not I'd want to feed you any of that. So, let me just go ahead and grab some food from this. Uh, we'll grab, like, half. There we go. Cool. We'll just give this, uh, this rock drake some food. Actually, you know what? Just to heal it real quick, I'm going to use my snow owl. Boom. Yeah, that's right. I'm able to use this on here because I wanted to. <laughs> 
All right, we're just gonna get this thing healed real quick. All right, so let's test out this rock drake. Now, it's been a little while since I've used a rock drake, so just bear with me while I kind of figure out how to use them again. Um, all right. And then, what is it again? Okay, there we go. That's how you do that. How do I... I know I have, like, a way of, like... I'll do those boost things where it, like, dives at something. And then, how do I stop that? I think it's a right-click. Yeah, that's what it is. So, sometimes you can use that just to kind of get around a little bit. I actually really like using that. Um, so, let's see. Let's try and get up a little bit. I don't seem to be able to get any crosshairs, though, unfortunately. Let's get down here, then. God, I love rock drakes. They are so fun. That noise makes me nervous. It almost makes me feel like I'm actually going to start taking damage or something. By the way, the little uh, one damage thing that you see there, I don't know if that shows up if you don't have the damage numbers appearing, but that's actually, that's my armor. That's not like the rock drake, and that's not like, you know, that's not my uh, light pet taking damage or anything. That's just like a essentially my my armor getting slightly damaged every second um it's just kind of what happens down here so i don't know if that shows up unless you have the numbers actually showing not 100 percent sure about that one all right so let's get that point into stem let me see are there any rock drake eggs around here we definitely have one right here yeah let's just climb up to it so I probably already checked a lot of these, but I do need to actually grab quite a few of them. Let's see, that one was a level, what was that 24? Okay, yeah, we can grab that one just to kind of get rid of it. Um, we should probably also kill some of these rock drakes just to clear the area a little bit. Can I actually shoot? What the hell? Please, shotgun work. What is... <sighs> this is so annoying. When creatures are like super close to you, you just don't seem to be able to actually use weapons on them, which is really irritating and it always happens to me with raptors i don't know why boom i think they kind of like get right up into your face or something there we go now it's working where's the other one <laughs> get wrecked all right let's see can we get up here then uh can i start climbing thank you all right let's just go ahead and grab this thing then and this will obviously alert pretty much every single rock drake in the area to me but that's good we'll just kind of like move them away from the nest um, so let me go ahead and get my shotgun reloaded and then I want to go ahead and maybe also eat this egg just to kind of get rid of it we don't need a level 24 nobody needs a level 24 trust me okay here we go let's uh go ahead and just move oh my god there's actually a ton of them from out there yeah that is probably a little bit too many um they're they're likely all gonna just come to me so let me use the spino let me use the Spino to take them out. Boom. Okay. Yeah, there's so many of them here. This is crazy. So the Spino is obviously going to be taking just a little bit of damage. Uh, I didn't... Did I bring... Oh, I did bring it, but it's fine. I'm not going to leave this thing out for too long at all. So I'm okay just taking the damage for the moment from the radiation. And... Uh, almost... Oh, we got one more contender right here. Hello. Come on. There you go and goodbye sweet all right let's go ahead and put you away then uh but maybe grab those feathers eight of those sweet okay and let me also just pop that in there we could probably feed a couple of these so it gives like a hundred health per nameless venom which is just ridiculously good it's super handy for rockwell like honestly i i love that that's a thing but it's also extremely op it's probably a little bit more OP on Magnosaurs because, like, you can easily get Ambergris. Like, it's way easier to get the Nameless Venom. So, yeah. Um, I just, I like that that's a thing. It's kind of interesting that they didn't do anything like that for Wyverns, though. Let's see. Uh, what level is that? A 114. Okay. Pretty terrible. So, we're probably going to have to go through this whole trench and just see if we can find any good eggs at all. To be honest, I almost kind of preferred stealing them on the uh, back of my Bloodstalker. That was really interesting because the Bloodstalker is very uh fast and everything it's just the the issue with that is that i can't really fight anything uh because the bloodstalker kind of sucks so i don't know it's like it's great for getting in and out but like actually you know killing things and defending myself is just a no-go with that thing i just gotta leave if anything bad happens let's see uh got another egg here and we could probably try to grab this one in time before these guys get up to me yeah we're good 
108. Boom, 108. Pretty terrible so far. Let's see. Uh, level 60. Is it new though? I'm trying to see its little bar. You know what? I could just pick it up first. Uh, level 60. Yeah, that one's actually brand new. So is the 114. So let's just go ahead and eat all three of these because we don't need them. And we also got to keep an eye on the health of this rock drake. I'll just feed the rest of this nameless venom just to keep it uh, nice and healed right now. Um, unfortunately, all of these rock drakes are kind of trying to get to me right now. So we can just like move through a little bit. Um, okay. Definitely feel a little bit rust. Oh my God. <laughs> you guys see this? I feel a little bit rusty on the rock drake right now. Feels like I need a little bit more practice to kind of uh, get used to them again. Definitely been quite some time since I've used one though. Probably like maybe the best part of a year, almost. I don't know. We had a really cool one in our last uh, cluster. I really like that one. Let me actually try and get the kill on this rock drake just to get it some levels. Um, we can switch to the other one in a little bit. I feel like maybe we probably shouldn't have used this one anyway, because this one has like a lower health. And there you go. Sweet. Okay, so we've got you know what I could probably just we can use the tech suit down here so I could just like tech my way around a little bit while there's no rock drakes so what level is this one here 24 okay and then let's grab this one too that one is a level 18 I think it said just before I grabbed it is there another one at all oh there's another one right ah! okay well that's terrifying yeah we gotta get down to our dude Okay, I could probably just kill this rock drake and then continue. Although now there's two of them. Um, come on. Oh, now there's three. Okay, bud, we're gonna need to uh, get out of here. Great. I did not think there was this many around. I guess this is why I should use the tech suit down here. All right. Well, you know what? What level was that one? I think that was the 204. We do have another 204. That was dumb. I, ah, man, that was really dumb. Why did I let that happen? I could have just like hopped straight down, went back to the rock drake, man maneuvered around a little bit. I don't know. Really should have done that. Ah, why do I do so many dumb things? All right. Well, you know what? We can just go ahead and kill all these guys, grab our saddle, and then continue grabbing eggs because we do have another rock drake on us here. And let's see. Yeah, these guys must be high levels. Oh, maybe not. We're only doing like 77 damage right now, so they are mate boosted, unfortunately. Boom. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. Sweet. Okay, so this one here is going to die pretty quick now. Wow. How the hell did I let that happen? Okay. Well, yeah, that was really dumb, but it is what it is. Uh, it's okay. See, that is not my rock drake, but there is a feather. Where exactly did my one die? We might need to... Oh, there we go. This is it here. Cool. All right. You know what? It's it's absolutely fine. It's going to be okay. Let's see. <laughs> oh, my God. How the hell did I let that happen? Boom. Level 30. Kind of awful, but okay for the moment. And I think we've already checked these nests over here, right? They didn't get filled again. Okay, cool. So let's, uh, let's grab out the other rock drake and lead it to its doom, just like that one. Boom. And saddle and hop on. And you are already pretty low on health. You see, they grow up quicker than they can heal, unfortunately, with my stats. So, yeah, not super good. Let's go ahead and get that stam up, though. Oh, what? Oh, good. I didn't throw it out. That's, that's great. I thought I accidentally threw something there. Come on, be a good egg, please. A level 24. Terrible, absolutely terrible. I don't even know if that one's worth grabbing because there's so many. All right, I should be able to get away though. We haven't even grabbed a single half decent egg. Like every single egg has been like around level 100, if not lower. Uh, okay. I think there was a nest back here that I missed. Uh, right there, yeah try and get to it yeah there we go all right please be a good egg uh let's see i'm trying to delatch, but it just didn't seem to want to happen let's see what level is this level 18 
terrible. I, oh my god, I do not want to get caught in that big mess right there. All right, let's try and get away here. It, there we go. Yeah, uh, this is a bust. There's like no good eggs. Um, we could probably go back through the areas that we've already been to and grab like the empty nests if there's if they've been like refilled or whatever. Um, but yeah, no, this has been awful. <laughs> It's been absolutely awful. Probably like the worst run I've ever had. Not even a single half decent one. Oh, there we go. Yeah, they are respawning. Nice. Okay. Let's uh, try and maneuver our way over to here. What level is this? Please delatch. There we go. 24. Awful. Okay, you know what? Let me just... My taxi is going to probably break any second now, so we got to be cautious here. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, 24 as well. Great. Why are the level 24s mating and breeding and, and making eggs? Like, this is not okay. All right, I should probably try and get out of here while I still have a good amount of health left and uh, get some healing going and whatnot. But uh, this has been an awful run. Seriously, just terrible. I guess we could just quickly check these nests if there are any filled ones right there. Perfect. Uh, how, how much... Durability. Okay, no, we actually have a good amount left. I thought we had a lot less. Let's see. Just go ahead and kill this one. Boom, boom, and boom. Dead. Sweet. Okay. There's actually maybe another nest over there. Okay, please be good. Nope, terrible. Is this one full? Nope. Nothing in there. And we also have an empty one there, and we have this one here. What do you have for me? A level 180. Okay. At least there's actually something that's half decent. Um, that's not, that's not bad. Boom. That is not awful, but it's still not great. Obviously, 228 is the max level on here for rock drakes and, you know, wyverns and other stuff because I have max level 180 for normal creatures. So it's not the most amazing thing, but it's, it's definitely okay. There could be some good stats in it. Um... Try and see if I can... Oh, level 18. Okay, awful. Absolutely awful. All right, I think we're going to get out of here while we still have this Rock Drake alive, and uh, maybe we can hatch up this 180. I really thought we'd get, like, a couple half-decent ones, but no. Not at all. All right, here we go, and boom! Hatched up. That's actually a nice-looking Drake. That looks like probably a valentine's event one that was like left still in the area and then obviously made an egg um does it have some good stats though that health actually looks okay let me see uh it will take me a little while oh wait no that health is not good it's gonna take me a little while to kind of get used to some of the good stats to look out for in rock drakes oh that's interesting i never realized wait i do i have another rock drake i do right here uh, you know what? I'll just look in here instead. I never realized that rock drakes actually don't have any points into movement speed. Huh. I guess that's that's weird because like only flyers in the game uh, don't have points into movement speed. So that's it's kind of odd that it doesn't. But all right. I'm OK with that. Like it's definitely makes it better. So you have more points on, into all the other stats anyway. So. Yeah, I just never knew that, I guess. Uh, that's cool. All right, well, anyway, uh, we actually do have another 204 here. So the one that we lost, it's okay. It was a twin, and we will just have to break the news to it later. So, um, yeah, that's pretty good. This one here is not a very good drake, but it does have some nice colors, though. So maybe we could kind of just, like, keep it around as, like, a prize drake. Let's see. Boom. Yeah, look at you. I mean, like... Really nice colors, actually. I do like that orange with that purple. That is a very nice combination together. Let's see. Uh, let me turn my guy off like that. Yeah, it's, it's kind of hard to, like, see the proper colors without any, like, weird uh, interference in terms of, like, other lights and, and shaders and stuff around here. But, um, I don't know. I think it's a pretty nice-looking Drake. No, here's the thing. We, we got to go down there again. We got to like head back down at some point and just like clear the whole trench grab every single egg that i can find and then do it again and then do it again and then after that one more time because we need the best of the best in terms of drakes if we're ever gonna fight rockwell like obviously i, I want a really good stamina and health drake for that i don't need melee damage for that fight it's not really uh something that we're gonna have to worry about uh here's the thing though 
I'm almost kind of considering doing Rockwell on foot because I know it's possible and I've never done it on foot. So I think that actually be, could be kind of interesting as well. So I don't know what we're going to end up doing in the end, but uh, hopefully it's exciting either way. Um, so yeah, you know what? Let me just have another quick look at these rock drakes that we have and let me chuck this one in here as well. Again, not really much point of me raising up every single one of these. Like I can raise them up if I desperately need them, but... For the moment, though, it doesn't really look like I have a super good Drake for Rockwell. Like, we had really good stem on this one here, 40 points, but it's not... Oh my god, wait, 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 I didn't. I never even noticed this one here. This one here is 50 points into stamina. Dude, that's dope. That's the 222, by the way, from the last episode. Uh, that is actually really good. 50 points. Goddamn. Okay, I, I don't know if I want to actually do any rock drake breeding at all in this series. We did that in the last one, but um, I don't I don't know if I want to actually breed creatures like that. You know, unbreedable creatures, like, should I be breeding them? Probably not, because it's not a thing that you can actually do in-game. Obviously, I can do it with my fancy mods and everything, but if you're not able to do it in-game, then I don't know if I should be doing it in my videos for you guys. I don't know. Let me know what you guys want to see. Like, if you want to see me breed some rock drakes, I guess we can do it. But uh, I think we'll probably try and defeat a, ro a, a rock drake. Rockwell with a rock drake that was legitimately, uh, you know, just hatched or whatever. So, yeah, I think that's probably going to be it for today, guys. Uh, we, we didn't really come out of this episode as planned. Like, I was kind of hoping to have some really, really good uh, new eggs and everything like that. But uh, it just, it didn't really pan out as well. So, if you guys did enjoy the video, anyway, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. And uh, I'll catch you in the next one.